Welcome to the Midweek Pause, sponsored by The Hub. I'm Joe Barto, Hub Coordinator. Remembering that we are in God's presence this evening, we pause to ask God for help in our prayer. Loving God, you call us beloved. Many times we may have felt unworthy of this title, unworthy of your love. As we gather here tonight, give us a deeper insight into your word. Give us strength to proclaim your gospel message in word and action. Help us to be bold disciples so that we and those that we come in contact with may come to know you more fully. Blessed are you, O Lord, whose word makes evening fall. Amen. Today's scripture is from Matthew chapter 11. At that time, Jesus proclaimed, I give praise to you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth, for although you have hidden these things from the wise and the learned, you have revealed them to little ones. Yes, Father, such has been your gracious will. All things have been handed over to me by my Father. No one knows the Son except the Father, and no one knows the Father except the Son and anyone to whom the Son wishes to reveal him. Come to me, all you who labor and are burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am meek and humble of heart. And you will find rest for yourselves, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Something to think about this evening, in your own life right now, what burdens do you need to let go of? What burdens do you need to let go of and put into the Lord's hands? Our response is, go out to all the world and tell the good news. Praise the Lord, all you nations. Glorify him, all you peoples. Go out to all the world and tell the good news. For steadfast is his kindness for us, and the fidelity of the Lord endures forever. Go out to all the world and tell the good news. For our intercessions this evening, we pray, Lord, hear us. We pray for all refugees as they flee the countries that no longer provide them safety. We pray, Lord, hear us. We pray for anyone who is struggling with their faith right now. We pray, Lord, hear us. We pray for those who weep with grief. We pray, Lord, hear us. We pray for families that are torn apart by addiction and divorce. We pray, Lord, hear us. Hear us. We pray for all who will die tonight and all who minister to them. We pray, Lord, hear us. We pray for all who find themselves having to let go of what once was. We pray, Lord, hear us. Let us take a few moments to recall two or three things that happened today for which we are especially grateful. Take time to savor them and then thank God for these gifts. Let us review our day, noticing where you experience God's presence. Notice everything large and small. When did you love and when did you feel loved? Let us recall a time when we have sinned today or done something that we now regret. Express your sorrow to God and ask for forgiveness.
And as we breathe out fear and worry, and we breathe in peace, light, and grace, let us ask God for the grace for the rest of this evening and into tomorrow. Let us pray. Let us go forth knowing that we are loved unconditionally, knowing that the Lord guards us by day and by night, and knowing that he needs and calls us to be his disciples as long as we have breath. Have a blessed evening.